is up, ladies and gentlemen of the online jam lead. This, of course, here is Jamira Fan 2000 with another episode of Jamira Reviews for the uninitiated in this series on my YouTube channel. This has been my recurring series on my YouTube channel looking at brand new Jamira Kwai merchandise, be it official, be it unofficial. But uh, as I did the last episode of Jamira Reviews, I looked at the uh, new Mercy on Planet Earth hoodie, which is part of the most recent merchandise drop here in the latter part of 2023. And overall, it was a pretty cool ho hoodie running around $65 on the official Jamira Kwai store. But uh, this second Jamira Reviews video consecutively is going to be looking at the new 10th anniversary reissue of Late Night Tales Jamira Kwai on double 180 gram LP vinyl. Now, for any members of the family who don't know about Late Night Tales Jamira Kwai, Late Night Tales was a series over in the UK where they picked some very prominent musical artists to come and pick a playlist of some of the music that influenced them and their music making and overall the music that they love. And uh, Jamira Kwai just will happen to be picked back in 2013 or in this case JK to pick a playlist of all the music that he grew up on that inspired him to make music on his own right well the fine folks at Late Night Tales finally reissued Late Night Tales on vinyl here in the, or early to mid-December of 2023. And if you're wondering, they released um, they reissued, reissued it in two editions. One with the traditional black 180-gram uh, vinyl double LP release. And the other one is a limited edition Lily White 180-gram um, uh, double LP vinyl reissue. And... Um, the lily white ones look absolutely beautiful, but I just so happened to get a copy of it myself, and I thought I'd do a Jamira Reviews video to show you off the new vinyl uh, reissue of Late Night Tales. So I uh, got it right here, and I would like to send a big thank you to uh, some friends of mine for sending me this vinyl uh, so early, too, on the offset. But here you go. This is the Jamira Kwai Late Night Tales double LP vinyl reissue. Now, this is a double LP. This isn't just a single LP. This is a double LP. And, um, What's so cool about this, it's got a actual, the, the, when this originally came out 10 years ago on CD and on limited edition vinyl, when this came out originally in limited edition vinyl back in 2013, it was not readily available unless you were in, I believe, the countries of the UK and Japan. But uh, they decided with the 10th anniversary to reissue this. And what's so cool, it has really cool liner notes on the back. Really cool lineup. Now, these liner notes... And I will be transcribing these onto the twin subreddits of the online family in time. So give me time. It is the holidays, and I've been otherwise busy, so you notice me recording videos here at my job. But um, I will be transcribing these liner notes. And what's so cool about this edition, it has brand new anecdotal um, uh, comments from JK on each song from his compilation of Jamiroquai's Late Night Tales. So let's go ahead and crack this open. But like I said, I got the black... 180 gram a double LP vinyl edition. I would get the Lily White, but you know I get what I get, and I appreciate them sending me this. But uh, let's look at take a look at the. It comes with a slip K, uh, a slip mat of the beautiful artwork for Jamaica White Late Night Tales, and also on the back we have the track list. Now, if you freeze the video, I'm sure you can read this on your own, but like I said, this will be something else I additionally transcribe for the online family who otherwise were not able to buy this vinyl edition. But as you can see, each one of the songs has a cool little anecdotal comment by JK talking about each song on the Late Night Tales to Mary Quai compilation, and that's a cool little art flat. So let's look at the vinyls. Now, the vinyls, like I said, are both 180-gram uh, black standard vinyls, and they come in these lovely very perforated uh, slip mats, or should I say vinyl mats. Now, uh, bear in mind, this does come along with a digital edition. As you can see right here, I'm covering up the code so I can get it for myself, but this does, there is codes on the, the inside slip of the vinyl release where you can get the digital version for free for buying the vinyl. Now, this is something that, that's been happening with Jamira Kwai vinyl releases as of recently, but back during in the 2013 reissues of some of the Jamira Kwai vinyl album releases, most notably Immersing Planet Earth of the Tribe Without Moving, they came with codes where you could download digital copy of the album for your digital collection. So, you, not only do you have vinyl, you get digital. So, they did it, they also did it for Late Night Tales. So, so, uh, yeah, keep your eyes out for that code if you happen to buy this. But here you go. Traditional black LP vinyl. I'll give you a good look at the inside spool art. But basically, just an outline of the beautiful little dog from the artwork. But, uh, yes, both vinyls are pretty much the same. 
Uh, this vinyl set is running around, I believe, 26 pounds. Um, that would translate to about 32 to 33 dollars in American money. But uh, it is plentifully available right now at all the major online musical retailers, um, especially in the UK and, of course, in the European Union and the United States. Um, but uh, overall, I love I love the Nate Late Night Tales compilation. Now there was a compilation with J by done by J.K. back in the day on um, in Japan during I believe it was the Return of the Space Cowboy era. Uh, they did a compilation called Jay's Selection. It was only released in the Japanese market. But what was so cool about that? That was a first collection of some of J.K.'s favorite songs. You know, just a basic compilation. But uh, what's cool is the artwork looked like a bowl of what looks like soup, and they had a bread buffalo man on the top of that so if you want to check out that original compilation it's called jay's selection you can find it on discogs just go to discogs look up jamiroquai jay selection it's a really cool rare comp first um some of the music jk some of jk's favorite music compilation they did during the return of the space cowboy era but um this compilation is the second one for late night tales jamiroquai and like i said absolutely love this i love the i love the i love the the new write-up they did on the back right here I'll give you a good close-up of that so you can freeze frame it, read it in your own time. Oh, let me pull it up a little bit. Just give you a few seconds. Yeah. If you want to read this for yourself, just freeze frame the video on YouTube and read it there. But I will be transcribing all the anecdotal comments by JK song by song of this Late Night Tales final edition. And I will be transcribing this write-up on the back, which was in the liner notes of the original CD and limited edition vinyl release of um, Jumeric Wide Late Night Tales back in 2013. But there you go. This is the 2023 reissue of the 10th anniversary of Jumeric Wide Late Night Tales. Massive, awesome, great compilation and another great pretty much career and a career finishing addition to the vinyl collection of Jumeric discography, which in 2022 and 2023 saw finality. So now one of JK's original wishes, he's done this in many interviews, he said he's always wanted to have all the Jamiroquai albums of the discography, including compilations, on wax. So now it's all available. Uh, you can find this at the official Late Night Tales Bandcamp if you want to buy a digital version. There's digital versions in Lossless and Basic MP3 that are available for pay download at the same site. And both this edition and the Lily White, limited edition Lily White dub 180 gram vinyl issues are all plentifully available so if you'd like to get this final set for yourself um you will be getting in after christmas because it's pretty much the middle of december but if you'd like to get this compilation for yourself on vinyl or in digital i'll be sure to put a link down in the description area of this episode of jamira reviews down below so you can pre-order in your own time but again massive thanks to the lovely folks for sending me a copy of this i really do appreciate it really good christmas we got and um thank you again for watching this episode of jamira reviews and the, and the one prior to this one about the uh, mercy and planet Earth hoodie i hope you enjoyed these jamira reviews videos. I love doing them so I can, you know, do a little bit of my own proverbial word of mouth for new Jamiroquai merchandise. And I recently also did another one for the recently SH Figure Arts Japanese release of the JK Virtual Sanity figurine. So be sure to check that out on my channel too as well. But as always, this is Jamirofan2000. Thank you again for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe and be sure to ding the bell on your YouTube to stay up to date on all the latest videos coming from the Jamirofan2000 YouTube channel as we march into the new, uh, march into the holiday season and head into 2024 for hopefully a lot of news ha happening with Jamiroquai's ninth album that is hopefully going to be coming out sometime time in late 2024 and early 2025. But as always, this is Jamira Fan 2000. Thank you again for watching and I'll see you again really soon with more Jamira Quiet related videos here on the Jamira Fan 2000 YouTube channel. Bye bye everybody and happy holidays.